Hello, my friends. Welcome to another episode of Stephanie's Stamp Pad, where we get together in my craft room and we make a card. Now, I do wish I could have all of you over. Wouldn't that be so much fun? We could just have everybody here and but sadly my house is way too small for that. <laughs> but it would be so much fun. So this is the next best thing where you get to stay in your pajamas and I get to wear my shorts and we don't have to worry about anything. And oh, you know what, look. I get to wear my slippers too. <laughs> okay, I'm such a dork. Let's make a card. Today's card is this fun, beautiful, adorable, oh, I love that grid die in the background. Look at this, it's your birthday. Isn't that gorgeous? I love it, it's one of my favorites. Now, let me show you what you need to create this card. You're gonna need the Windows die set that I designed for Sizzix. And the item number is 659651. You're also going to use this, I think we call this, I don't know, what's the name of this one? I never know the names and I can never find the names in fast. But I think it's like the tags or I don't know. Oh gosh, oh my word, where is the name? Now I'm like on a mission. Maybe it's on the front. Oh well, it's this one. Fra oh, there it is, oh, front. phrases. So phrases. And then we're gonna use balloon to cut from Stamps of Life. Then we're going to use green apple, cloud, uh, ocean, banana, and also licorice. Let's get started. Now, the first thing we're gonna do is create our base. And look at this, it's just an eight and a half by 11, folded, cut in half and folded in half. Boom, that was easy. Then what we're gonna do is we need to make this grid. Now, we're going to use the two dies that come in the kit. And if we use just one, it would stay in the card. So we need to use this larger die at the same time to die cut it. But we need to put Sizzix adhesive on the back because if we don't, we have to try to add adhesive to each of these little pieces, and are you kidding me? I am not doing that. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna get a piece of Sizzix adhesive. It comes in packs of um, 10, and they're six by six. I've already trimmed this one down a little. So we're just gonna peel that off. Don't touch this, and there's this little lip on here, so put your fingers on that, and we're gonna lay this down. Does that fit that way? Nope, we're gonna go this way. Now, let me tell you a hint. If you just take this paper, turn it over and die cut, you're gonna die cut in the wrong spot and you're gonna be sad. So I highly recommend you trim this down so you know that everything that you are die cutting has adhesive on it. Now, let me make sure this is the good size. Yes, it is, okay. So we're just gonna take, whoops, take this and we're gonna trim this off. There we go. Now we know this is all sticker, okay? We're gonna lay that down and we're gonna lay these two dies down and we're gonna run this through. Dun, 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 dun. I love this die, it is so much fun. It's a very popular one. Now we wanna go a little bit at an angle so we don't have any speed bumps, so line that up again. Of course I'm using my magnetic platform. Did you see how it snapped just there? I hope you can see that that just happened. So we just wanna move the die a little. There we go. And we're gonna lay that down and run that baby through. Now, we need to do some stamping and I've actually already done that. So here I've stamped my cute little balloons. We're gonna peel this up. And now, save these squares, because how, and don't forget they all have adhesive on the back. So how cute would it be to make a card using that? So we're just gonna pop those out. And look at this fun grid. Oh my word, isn't that adorable? Isn't that cute? I love it. And the best part, it has adhesive on the back, so we don't have to worry about it. So we're going to lay this down. Peel this up, sometimes, there we go. Peel that up, try not to touch it. Sometimes we get little hairy guys in there, that's okay. And we're gonna peel this and we're gonna lay this down and look at how it, it layers perfectly on an A2 size card. It's like magic, but no, it's not. Because I tried to think of everything and I'm a little crooked, oh, I'm awful. Okay, so now what we're gonna do is we are, we've already stamped these, we're gonna die cut these and let's get our dies. And luckily one's already die cut for me because you don't wanna watch me die cut these back and forth, back and forth. But we'll die cut the yellow one. And the nice thing about the magnetic platform is we don't have to worry about it moving once we get it in the right spot. Right there. And let's do the little baby blue. I'm gonna lay that guy right there. And this one's already die cut for me, so we'll just pull that one out of my samples. Oh, and it even has it here. 
My team is amazing. They even put the string on that one for me. Okay, so we're gonna run this through. Sometimes I call them little elves, but my team is a fantastic. They help me prep a lot of these because I don't have time to do all the prep work. I have to, I'm busy designing. You don't want me to spend time prepping because then my time would be kind of wasted. So I have people for that. Okay, so now that goes back with that. Now what we're gonna do is we need to, oh, we're gonna use some of those stamps. And I do have some samples over here. So we are using, which stamper? Well, we're using the dotted star, which is so cute. I gotta make sure I grab the right one. Okay, it's this one. So we wanna get a little tiny baby block right there. And we're gonna use the storm, oh, I'm sorry, cloud ink. And this is gonna be on scratch. So let's move this over here. Let's stamp this right there. There we go. And I think we're just adding two little stars just for fun. So we're gonna line that up there and just stamp. Line that up there and stamp, cute, cute. And then what we're gonna do is we're also going to stamp this one. Do I have this? I, here I do, I already have. I use this stamp set all the time, so I have tons of these. And we're gonna do It's Your Birthday. It's Your Birthday. How come this one looks small? Well, that's right. Okay, so we're gonna use that same block and we're gonna, ooh, I, yeah, this is black. And let's see, I don't know if that's gonna, oh, it did, even though that was the first time on that one. So now we are going to, oh, messed up. Look at that, woo. Why did I mess, how did I mess up? How did I mess up, do you know? Do you know? I'm gonna die cut this, so do you know how I messed up? Look, totally looks awesome, but when I lay this down to center that, Dun, dun, dun. Sad face. So what we're gonna do is we're gonna do it right there. There's no mistakes in crafting. There's only creative expression. There we go. Now we're gonna grab this over here. Grab this over here, look at that, fantastic. And we're gonna run that through. I'm using my small cutting pad so I don't have to wait for it to go all the way through. There we go. And look at that, mistake averted. There's no such thing as a mistake, right? So now let's get a pop dot or foam square, whatever you want to call it. Oh, come on, okay. And as if you watch any of these videos, you know I have a love-hate relationship with these things. I love them, but I hate them. <laughs> I hate them, but I love them. <laughs> okay, so now we're gonna add this one right here. Cute, cute, cute. Sometimes it's so much fun to use white cardstock. You'd think, oh, it's so boring, but sometimes it just gives you such a nice, am I out of adhesive? <gasps> am I? No, okay. Um, sometimes it just gives you such a nice look. So we're gonna lay this down, and I probably should use my twine behind that already, because we just did the twine right behind it. So we're just gonna stuff that in there. There we go. And we have the green. Oh, the green's popped up, so let's get some pops. Pops, we need to call those pops. And let's get the, oh, the blue's popped up too. Oh, goodness, okay. These things just love to hate me, hate to love me. Okay, so we're gonna peel that off. We're leaving on a jet plane tonight to go to the Richmond, Virginia show. So um, we're taking the red eye. Ken likes to put me in the mental hospital and makes me take the red eye sometimes. And um, we have to leave the house at 9.30 tonight and to get to LAX and that's gonna be a lot of fun. But I love to go to these shows because I get to see all my friends and I get to see all of you and we get to have fun and we're gonna trim this down. So if an event is ever near you, you need to come see us because we have lots of fun. So we're gonna grab all of these. Now don't email us and say, oh, I wanna see you in Virginia because when you see this video, Virginia will be over. And we're gonna tie this, but check out our website for an event near you. We travel the US and we're gonna tie this bow. And 
Ooh, I got quiet all of a sudden. Ooh, that was weird, huh? And we need to get like a glue dot thing. Every once in a while I am quiet. I think it freaks people out though when I am. It kind of freaks me out too because um, then it's like no one's listening. The other day I was walking and this lady was talking and she's like, oh, sorry, I was talking to the birds. <laughs> and I go, that's okay, I talked to my dog. So it was cute though. She thought I th thought she was talking to herself and I honestly didn't even notice she was talking, but it was funny. Okay, so we're gonna add that there. I kind of wish that knot was a little, oh, come on, you seriously have to stay there. Oh my goodness, I just pulled, my finger has one of them. I hate those glue things. Okay. Oh my gosh, now it's on this side. It's, it flipped, hang on. Ugh. Okay, that bow is like a reject. There we go, that's better. Okay, so now we're gonna trim these little guys because we don't wanna reject here. And look at that, that turned out cute. Oh, and you know what, I'm gonna trim these a little bit more too now. And actually, I'm gonna trim them to different lengths because that makes it more realistic looking. Look at that, isn't that adorable? So much fun, it's your birthday. That's a nice birthday card to get. Thanks so much for joining me for another episode of Stephanie's Stamp Pad where we get together and make a card and I will see you again next week. Bye bye. Even though you got it, it's never like you got it